there are um, 26 actuators per arm, like 26 electric, like motors, gearboxes, and power electronics. We bet you've never imagined a future where robots are not only intelligent, but also able to learn faster than humans. Yes, it may sound a bit scary, but it's exactly the kind of thing we should be focusing on right now. With its 26 actuators, the all-new hand design, the Tesla Bot Gen 3, is shaking the world by teaching itself 100 new tasks every single day just by watching videos. It's absolutely insane. Imagine how many skills it could master in a month or a year. That number would be staggering. By the time it officially launches at Tesla's event this November, Elon Musk promises that these bots will be able to make breakfast, prepare lunch for us to take to work, and do all the housework. And instead of pulling out your phone and typing out a Google search or asking chat GPT, you'll simply say, hey Optimus, how's Tesla stock doing today? In just a minute, you'll receive a direct answer narrated like a true financial analyst. And if you need more details, just glance at Optimus's OLED screen to check out the specific data you're interested in. It's hard to ignore a robot that can handle multiple tasks, communicate with people, and respond to commands, all for just $20,000, as confirmed by Elon Musk before. So, let's explore. How would a day as the Tesla Bot Gen 3's multi-purpose assistant look? And why is Elon Musk so confident in selling them for only $20,000? Welcome to Tesla Car World. We believe that most of us still can't imagine the idea of asking a robot to help with a specific task. It seems so far-fetched, right? When it comes to humanoid robots already on the market, most of them look clumsy, slow, and almost useless. Honestly, many people think humanoid robots are nothing more than a pile of scrap metal, let alone something worth tens of thousands of dollars. But with the Tesla Bot Optimus, Elon Musk confidently declared that 80% of Tesla's future value will come from the humanoid robot Optimus, not electric vehicles. This marks a major strategic shift, where Tesla views Optimus as the biggest product in history and the key player in shaping the economic model of the future built on physical AI and automation. Tesla is preparing to produce millions of humanoid robots and will continue ramping up production until there are billions of Optimus units worldwide. As Elon Musk said, humanoid robots will exceed a billion units per year. In reality, these robots will take on countless tasks around your home, and all you'll need to do is spend $20,000 to get one. Elon Musk and the Tesla team have repeatedly discussed the range of tasks their Optimus robot can perform, from simple to complex. It's no coincidence that Tesla is confident they have the most advanced humanoid robot in the world. The greatest engineers of Tesla know they are racing against time to catch up with the two million years of evolution that have transformed the human hand into the most complex biomechanical structure ever to exist on Earth. If there's one part of the body with the most complex movement, it's the hand. The human hand can perform countless motions, gripping, pulling, pushing, snapping, pressing, and chopping. Try listing similar movements for any other part of the body, and the hand will always come out on top. Our hands have 27 degrees of freedom, allowing us to perform any task within our capabilities. With five agile fingers, hundreds of sensory nerves, and an incredibly sophisticated mechanical structure, the human hand is the perfect tool for creativity, labor, and intellectual expression. As such, creating a machine that can replicate the flexibility and precision of the human hand has long been an ambitious dream in the field of robotics. It's a technological pinnacle that thousands of engineers from around the world have strived to achieve for decades. Whenever Elon Musk speaks about the potential of Tesla Bot Optimus to assist humans, he often compares it to C-3PO or R2-D2 from Star Wars. Musk believes that in the end, each of us will own a personal robot like that. But as Tesla continues to roll out impressive upgrades for the Optimus robot, it has also raised some concerns. Honestly, not everyone is excited about the idea of humanoid robots. Many worry about a future like the Terminator, where robots become more powerful and intelligent than humans. Instead of being controlled by us, they might dominate us, or at the very least, take our jobs. That's not what Elon Musk says he's building. According to him, Tesla plans to produce billions of these robots to help address the labor shortage. The idea is to free humans from repetitive tasks so we can focus on more creative and meaningful work. One particularly exciting development is Optimus's ability to handle dynamic, unpredictable movements. This adaptability is incredibly useful in real-world applications, whether it's working in a factory or doing household chores. These are constantly changing environments that require quick adjustments. 
With the vision of the world's wealthiest man, Musk believes that nearly all of human intelligence is carried out through our hands. He emphasizes that throughout millions of years of evolution, no part of the human body has been as important as the hands. From the very dawn of human consciousness, our ancestors were able to build great structures and perform complex tasks without needing advanced thinking. That's why Elon Musk and Tesla have made the hands the focal point of the Optimus robot's engineering. Musk believes that with these hands, Tesla bot will create a significant gap between itself and its competitors, making it the most sophisticated humanoid robot in the world. This robot could handle 100, 500, or even thousands of tasks. At the end of last year, Tesla released a demo of its new 22 degrees of freedom hand, showing Optimus flawlessly catching a tennis ball with impressive precision. But what few people know is that Optimus had to put in a lot of effort to achieve this, because 50% of the robot's mechanical complexity lies in this new generation of hands. The key difference here is how Tesla has developed Optimus. Unlike its competitors who focus and spend large amounts of money to make robots that can run, jump, or have a smart brain, Elon Musk said Tesla is not taking that route. Over half of the company's engineering efforts are dedicated to just one thing, the hands. Tesla has announced that Optimus features 22 degrees of freedom in its hands, 26 degrees of freedom in one arm, an unprecedented number for any commercial humanoid robot to date, while most others only have 5 to 6 degrees. Each finger can move independently, rotate, bend, twist, and even perform delicate touches like a real human hand. This means that Optimus isn't just limited to gripping or releasing objects like most industrial robots today. It can also perform complex tasks like typing on a keyboard, washing dishes, and more. One of the main reasons Optimus's hands stand out is that Tesla chose a motion system directly inspired by the human body, something the field of robotics has long considered too complex and difficult to mass produce. Instead of cramming motors directly into the hand, a common approach that often leads to bulky, heavy designs, Tesla moved all the main actuators down to the forearm. Then, an elastic cable system, mimicking the tendons of the human body, is used to pull, release, bend, and extend the fingers. This system works exactly like the human hand. Muscles in the forearm contract and transmit force through the tendons to control finger movements. The result? A lighter, more agile robot hand that is energy efficient and capable of extremely precise reactions. Each cable includes integrated force feedback sensors, allowing Optimus's AI to feel the gripping force and adjust accordingly. This enables the robot to hold an egg without breaking it, tighten a screw with the right torque, lift a coffee cup without spilling, and even sense the softness or hardness of different objects. This level of dexterity was previously limited to high-end robotics labs, but now it's been integrated into the hands of a commercial product. To achieve such ultra-compact and powerful actuation, Optimus needs to use high-performance servo motors and, importantly, permanent magnets made from rare earth elements. Unlike the large electric motors used in cars, the robot's hands require extremely small, yet powerful motors, with high precision. This presents a significant challenge for Tesla, as only super-strong permanent magnets can meet these strict specifications. However, over 80% of the global supply of rare earth magnets currently comes from China. Amid ongoing trade tensions between the two countries, China has started tightening export controls to protect its national technological interests. This has created significant challenges for Tesla in sourcing these critical components. Optimus is impacted by the rare earth magnet issue from China because the actuators in Optimus's arms rely on permanent magnets. Currently, Tesla doesn't generally need permanent magnets, but when something is constrained by volume like a robot's arm, you want to make the motors as small as possible. So, how does Tesla Bot Gen 3 handle household tasks? Imagine if a robot could take care of your daily chores, serving breakfast, mowing the lawn, folding clothes, or even tutoring children without any external help. Such a machine would instantly free up what most people value the most. Time, energy, and money. Elon Musk has repeatedly emphasized that Tesla's humanoid robot, known as Optimus, has the potential to take on repetitive, dangerous, or boring tasks that humans often shy away from. He's even suggested that owners could eventually find ways to generate income by deploying it. Despite this vision, public reactions remain divided. Many are still skeptical, wondering if they should spend $20,000 or even just half of that on a device they fear might become an expensive tech gadget that's rarely used in practice. 
The core of the debate lies in a simple truth. People turn to robots to simplify their lives. With work consuming nearly all of their day, the thought of returning home to unfinished chores can feel overwhelming. Now imagine a different scenario. You walk into a spotless home, dinner is already prepared, and the robot greets you with a cold drink as you relax. This isn't science fiction. Optimus is being built to make these experiences a reality. Tesla's influence in the electric vehicle market is undeniable, but its impact on the robotics field could be just as groundbreaking. Before 2020, Humanoid robots were largely considered impractical or unfeasible. However, once Tesla announced its ambitions, interest surged across industries worldwide. Many startups, particularly in China, quickly unveiled prototypes, some offering cheaper alternatives like the Unitree G1, priced around $16,000. However, in terms of engineering, large-scale production, and thoughtful design, Tesla seems to be in the best position to lead this field. One key reason is that the company focuses on human-scale proportions and usability. Optimus stands about 177 centimeters tall and weighs around 60 kilograms, not too heavy or bulky for household use. Tesla deliberately avoided using hydraulic actuators, prioritizing smooth operation over sheer power, an essential choice for domestic applications. Curiosity about the robot's operational capabilities is also widespread. Many wonder how long it can function on a single charge and how often it needs recharging. Tesla claims that Optimus can operate up to 20 hours a day, although skeptics point out that its 2.3 kilowatt hour battery makes this figure hard to believe. In reality, continuous operation may last around six hours before requiring a 15 to 30 minute recharge. To achieve the advertised 20 hours, multiple charging cycles would be needed. However, since the robot is not intended to replace factory workers, such extreme endurance is rarely required in everyday life. When discussing its learning capabilities, Musk explained that the robot can observe human activities through video and then replicate them. If realized, this feature could eliminate the need for intensive user training. By combining image data from four cameras with advanced machine learning algorithms, Optimus can automatically repeat complex tasks after just a few demonstrations. Imagine handing the kitchen over to the robot. Instead of fumbling with recipes, it will prepare a meal perfectly after studying a cooking video. It won't just serve dinner, it will clean up afterward too. The same principle applies to household chores like mopping the floor. Just show it a cleaning tutorial and you can enjoy your coffee while the robot takes care of the cleaning. The sophistication of Optimus lies largely in its hands. Nearly 80% of the success of tasks depends on dexterity. Each hand mimics the human structure with five fingers of varying lengths but Tesla has gone even further by continually improving flexibility and sensitivity. The latest version boasts 22 degrees of freedom, double the previous 11, making it the most advanced robot hand ever introduced. This leap allows for delicate handling, everything from carrying eggs or small tools to playing musical instruments or threading a needle. Musk has emphasized that these upgrades are a breakthrough, bringing Optimus closer to human-like skills. However, such capabilities raise concerns about the potential for misuse. If a robot can learn from any video, how can Tesla ensure safe applications? This concern is valid, although the rapid adaptability of video-based learning technology remains a powerful advantage in accelerating development and deploying frequent updates. Musk also explained that the robot can quickly perform general tasks, lifting a cup, picking up clothes, or folding them neatly. This adaptability highlights its potential role as a household companion rather than a replacement. For However, the commercialization of Optimus is still a few years away. Musk confirmed that widespread sales to consumers and businesses are expected to begin in 2026. Until then, production will remain limited, with initial models deployed internally for testing and research. Importantly, Tesla plans to implement a leasing program before retail sales begin. This strategy will allow potential customers to try out the robot firsthand while Tesla collects data and gradually expands its capabilities through software updates. Over time, leased units may gain new features, so by the time Optimus officially hits the market, it will be able to handle a range of household tasks. Musk himself summarized the plan by noting that the robot will initially be available for lease, followed by direct sales later on. As the race to commercialize humanoid robots heats up, one area quietly shaping market adoption is the rental model. Unlike outright purchases, leasing provides businesses with a lower barrier to entry, 
allowing them to experiment with cutting-edge robotics before committing to long-term ownership. Yet, the terms, flexibility, and transparency of these rental programs differ significantly across players, reflecting not just their technology readiness, but also their business strategies. Tesla's Optimus is perhaps the most anticipated newcomer, but when it comes to leasing details, information remains frustratingly sparse. The company has confirmed that Optimus will be available for rent prior to direct sale, but beyond that, everything else is speculation. Tesla has not disclosed whether rentals will be measured by the hour, day, or month, nor has it clarified who the target customers might be. A few non-official channels have floated the figure of $1,000 to $3,000 per month, but these remain unverified. For now, Tesla only hints that the program will begin within its factories, an internal proving ground, before potentially expanding outward. The lack of concrete terms leaves potential clients unable to forecast budgets or understand what commitments would be required, underscoring Tesla's tendency to prioritize vision over operational detail in its early announcements. In sharp contrast, SoftBank's Pepper program operates with the kind of structure one would expect from an established enterprise solution. For business deployments, Pepper is offered under a standard 36-month contract at 55,000 yen per month. This package isn't just about the robot itself. It includes application management platforms, technical support, and replacement coverage in case of malfunction. The model is clearly aimed at enterprises looking to integrate Pepper into front desk reception, retail, or market research roles. SoftBank has also shown flexibility in niche contexts such as RoboCup at home competitions, where Pepper can be rented on a short-term basis for events. By enabling local pickup at competition sites, the company helps teams avoid costly transportation, showing an attention to the practicalities of deployment that Tesla has yet to outline. Engineered Arts takes yet another approach with Amica, its lifelike humanoid frequently showcased at exhibitions and PR campaigns. Rather than standardized contracts, the company positions its offering as an end-to-end -end rental program tailored to limited engagements. Rental terms are entirely flexible, negotiated on a per-event basis, and aimed at marketing activations, educational settings, museums, or R&D environments. Pricing and exact durations are not publicly listed, requiring direct negotiation with the manufacturer. While this introduces some opacity, it also reflects a high-touch premium service approach where each deployment is customized to the client's objectives and audience impact. So, should Tesla reveal detailed rental terms early to build trust, or is it better to keep flexibility until Optimus is fully tested in-house? Please share your opinion in the comments section below this video. Thanks for watching our video. Subscribe now so you don't miss the next breaking Tesla update. It's coming in just two days. If you want to explore more exciting information about Tesla EV or Tesla Bot, don't forget to hit the like button and share this video. Also, make sure to turn on notifications so you never miss our latest videos. We appreciate your support and look forward to seeing you in the next video. Goodbye.